Now from Galaxy Airbrush, this Taurus Digital, right out of the box, comes ready to use. It's real simple, we have our adapters, and, and this is as quick and easily as it is to adapt. Let's say that we're going to use this quarter inch BSP that we have connected up to a Galaxy uh, Mercury 3000 Airbrush. Now, we're going to simply put on our adapter and we just want to thumb tighten that on. Now, remind you, this is straight out of the box. We're going to put that adapter on there. These have rubber seal, seal rings inside. No wrenches or pliers are necessary to get started. We're going to simply just thumb tighten this on and we're ready to spray. It's that simple, it's that easy. Now with our digital readout gauge, we're going to simply just press our button and turn it on. And you're going to note that when we decrease our air pressure or pull the, the button on our airbrush, it's going to give us our reading of our air pressure. Set this to your desired air pressure by simply turning it clockwise to increase that air pressure. And you'll note that we just brought it up to 36 PSI. We're going to set our button down, and when we spray, that's going to give us our reference point or our guide. Okay, you'll note that we have our compressor set at a maximum of the 5960 PSI in which this compressor produces. Now, spraying in what in your particular projects is your is your personal preference and what feels comfortable to you in spraying. What this digital gauge allows you to do is to simply go back to a reference point. To, to which you are comfortable spraying with. Let's say you're doing nail art and you want a lower air pressure. You simply pull up on your pressure gauge here and by turning it counterclockwise it will decrease the air pressure down to a desi your desired setting. Now, to, to adjust this air pressure you're going to want to release some air pressure from your, your airbrush and with that released you can adjust it to your desired setting this down. Now we've got to set it about 21 PSI.